Well, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God bless you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And welcome to this glorious year. The Lord bless you in Jesus' mighty name. If you're seeing me for the first time, my name is Samuel E. Molombe, and I am the man that God is using. I'm excited to come your way with God's word. I'm excited to come your way with just an amazing prophetic anointing. I believe that God has been faithful to you. I believe that this year that God has made us to see is just super amazing and a lot of good things will be in store for us. Amen. My God, the Lord has been, you know, laying a lot of amazing things in my mind. Um, just, I've just been here praying and thanking God for this new season. God has been showing me all that you are as a child of God and what um, you can do with Christianity. Now, notice I didn't say what Christianity can do for you, but what you can do with it. What you can do with the Spirit of God that is in the inside of you. Oh my goodness, what you can, what you can create with all that power. That dynamite that is inside of you, it's, it's, power, it's more powerful than uranium. You see, the power of God that is locked up in your spirit is more powerful than anything you can ever think about. And, and you just need to learn how to release that power. And, and you are going to not just have an amazing day or an amazing week or an amazing month, but you are going to have an amazing life. Glory to God in the highest. So the Lord is saying you got to speak to this person right now. God says you got to speak to this person right now. As you begin your year, I want you to listen to this prophetic word and make it a part of your playlist. Come back to it and listen to it again and again. And every time when you feel low, you feel like the devil is playing tricks on your mind, you need to come back to this word. Can we pray together? Heavenly Father, I thank you for your beloved child that you have brought up on this platform. I know it's not by uh, um, um, a coincidence or by chance that they are watching this prophetic video right now. You needed them to watch this. It's prophetic. You wanted them to come and see this amazing word that you have for them. Now I pray, Lord, speak to them in unique ways. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. So who is God saying you must speak to? You must speak to him. Yeah, that's him, God. Now, I know that's very religious. There are so many of you that, of course, you of course you pray every morning, um, religiously, ceremoniously. Oh, Father, thank you. No, 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 no. But see, you are created in the order of God. The Bible says in Psalms 82 that ye are gods and are all children of the Most High. Do you understand? You are not created lesser than God. You are born of God. The Bible says in 1 John that you are born of God. God literally. Now this is not some figurative. God literally gave birth to you. You know what that means? You have his DNA. You have his mind. Scripture says let this mind be in you which was first in Christ. Now, there you have, his, you have his thought pattern. You have his dynamic, creative power. You can, you can create things by merely speaking them or thinking them. Now, this is scary as it is powerful. Because, you know, um, Job said the thing I feared the most has come on me. So his fear created negativity for him. Family, the enemy cannot destroy you the enemy cannot destroy your month your year you know so what he does is that he tries as much as he can to get you to destroy you and this is why the lord is saying you got to speak to him every day you must be in communication with god all the days of this year i'm not just talking about you complaining and ranting about your troubles and your problems I'm talking about you coming to a place where you rub minds with God. You ask him questions. You, you tell him what you're thinking and you let him impact you. Let him activate those things that are in you. 
Now, so there is a whole arsenal, there is a whole weaponry in your spirit. There's a toolbox in your spirit, but you need to let God activate all those tools. Hallelujah. You need to listen to this again. I believe the Spirit of God will speak to you through this video again. You need to let God, you know, activate all this uniqueness that is within you. Then the world will see strange power released from your spirit. So, first resolution you have to do is make sure you dedicate at least an hour every day talking to God. An hour every day feasting on His Word. An hour every day listening to what He has to say. And believe you me, it will be a dynamic experience. And well, you know what? I am right here praying for you and trusting the Lord that you will have an amazing year. I am right here believing God that He will touch your heart and your mind. That He will take away the challenges that you might have been going through. You, you that is going through a depression in your mind. You that is going through sickness in your body. You that is going through a pain you don't know how to explain. Kind of like nobody understands what you're going through. I'm praying in the name of the Lord that God will take that out. And bless you. Hallelujah. And bless you so much that you will sing of the Lord's goodness. I declare the blessing of God upon you. I declare the love of God upon you. I declare that God is going to bless you beyond curse. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Shalom.